Hello, this is Craig from bitsbox.co.uk. In this painting tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to paint blue digital camo. So this has been requested that we do this as a tutorial. So I'm going to use this um, Jeans Dealer hybrid model from the Deathwatch Overkill box set. And I'm going to paint the pattern onto his trousers. So we begin by giving him a base coat of the fang. As always, I recommend doing two thin coats rather than one thick coat. This will give you a nice smooth finish to the base coat. And with that base coat fully dry, it's time to start painting on the pattern. So to start, I'm going to mix two colours together. I'm going to go back with the fang, and then we're going to take some Fenrisian grey. I'm going to mix this roughly two parts of Fenrisian grey to one part of the fang. This is just so the Fenrisian grey isn't too light when we start painting it on. It's important at this stage that the paint is nice and thin so it will flow easily off the brush. And essentially what I just do is paint some random squares and triangles just in random places. Um, sort of odd shapes help as well. Um, it's worth looking at um, blue digital camo um, photos just for reference. But essentially you just go around and have a miniature just painting these random shapes using the Fenrisian grey and the Fang mix. So now we have the start of our pattern. And you can see it's quite subtle which is what you want on these sort of camo patterns. So we're going to go in now with some Skaven Blight Dinge and essentially we're going to do exactly the same as before but this time just in different places. And I like to make it look like the um, previous mix of Fenrisian Grey and the Fang is sort of overlapping on top of this colour as you can see there. So sort of start painting your shape sort of underneath these and that will just give you the sort of impression that these patterns sort of overlap each other. And again, just keep it random and keep the shapes varied, and that'll just help sell the effect. So, with that, the pattern is essentially done. Just one little thing I'm going to do now, and that's just to add some shade into the recesses of the trousers. So with that, I'm going to use some null oil, and you want to focus this just in the recessed areas, um, around, around the armor plates, and in just the recesses like on the back of his knees. Um, you don't want to wash this all over the entire pattern, because then you'll end up just making it look a bit sort of um, dirty, and you don't want that. that is essentially it. So that is a blue digital camo pan. Uh, this tutorial is requested by one of our subscribers. Uh, if you'd like to see us do another tutorial then please leave a comment below on what you would like to see. As always if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video.